Good morning, children. I would like to welcome each and every one to AVS class. And today's date is 16 September 2020. Children, what are the things we are going to do for our class? I have written here. First, we are going to have a recap of what we have learned in our chapter. That is lesson number seven. And the name of the lesson is Our Green Friends. Then we are going to discuss workbook exercises. Okay, children. So let us begin our class with the recap what we have learned in our chapter. So what are the things we have learned? I have written here. So let us discuss one by one. We have learned that plants are also living thing. We know that plants are also living thing and they need food, water, air and sunlight to grow. Then next we have learned about the different parts of plant. We have learned that like we have our body parts, plants also have their parts. So what are the different parts of the plant we have learned? We have learned that root, it fixes the ground. It is below on the ground, okay? And stem is above the ground. Then we have learned about the leaf and even we have learned that leaves prepare food for the whole plant okay the leaf prepares plant for um, uh, food for the plant okay then even we have learned that stems collect water and distribute it in the different parts of the plant then we have learned that there are flowers okay you will find of different types and colors then fruit also flowers bear fruit and it will contain seed also that is present inside the fruit we have learned all these things in our last class then we have even learned that about the different types of plants so big plant means trees okay big plants are called trees what children big plants are called trees and some examples of trees are mango tree neem tree people tree banyan tree all big big trees and they are thick and strong okay they are thick they have thick branches and uh, stems and that they are strong and they live for many years okay children now moving to the next point we have learned about the small plants so small plants we have shrubs and herbs in it serbs you must know that serbs are stronger than herbs okay because strong serbs have woody stem but they are smaller than a tree both shrubs and herbs are smaller than trees and shrubs are but shrub is stronger than herbs and herbs have weak stem example of herbs are mint then coriander then you will find uh, tulsi um, basil okay these are the examples of her herbs then examples of shrubs are rose hibiscus these have woody stem okay they may be shorter in size but they have woody stem and shrubs and herbs the lifespan is less than the trees trees can live for many years but shrubs and herbs does not live for many years then last we have learned about the plants that need support children we have learned that plants there are plants that need support and you have seen also some of you might have at home that climbers money plant we use a, as a decoration we keep it as an indoor uh, plant okay then what we have seen children it needs support of something it can't stand straight it will fall down or it will bend but if you put support in it either it be a stick or some trees or you can give the support of the world then it will climb easily so climbers need support to grow okay and examples of climbers a money plant man, uh, pea then we have the um, beans then a pea plant okay these are the examples of climbers now moving to the last that is the creepers now what are creeper children those creep on the ground okay it spreads on the ground and examples are watermelon marshmallow pumpkin these are the examples of creepers okay children these are the important things from this lesson and we have already discussed now let us start with our workbook 
children get ready with the workbook and let us start with the workbook and the workbook pages in the, what we are going to do are from 31 to 36 we are going to do and children i'll be giving it in the google classroom also so that those who are unable to follow they can see and write from the uh, pdf okay i'll be making pdf and i'll be sending to you all okay let us start the class so workbook page number 31 which part of a tree grows below the ground the options are leaf root flowers and fruits below the ground that is that fixes the ground okay that is the root root always grow below the ground and the correct option is roots and that is number b then which part of a plant gives given below which part of a plant is given below you can see the picture and you can identify itself here yeah, children it is flower very good now moving to the next part fill in the blanks using the correct word from the bracket so they have given you already the answer only you have to find the correct one dash makes food for the plant who makes food for the plant children yes it's the leaf they they are also called the kitchen factory we have learned then dash fixes fixes the plant to the ground who fixes the plant to the ground it is the roots then Question number five, what plant part is given in the image? Children, there is a, a strawberry picture. What is it, children? It is the fruit. Then moving to next question, name the plant part given in the image, in the picture. That means image means picture. It's a given. And what it is, children? It is a leaf, L-E-A-F, leaf. Then moving to the next short answer question question number seven level the different parts of the plant children you have seen the parts they have given you few of them they have done for you and few three you, know, you have to do so first one is flower you can see only then leaf is also there then the stem is also there but what is not the children the root that is number b root you can see and the fruit that is number a a is fruit and b is root okay children then moving back to the next page page number 33 write yes or no that is question number eight herbs are tall and big plant is it children herbs are small plant okay so it's the sentence is wrong that means no the rose plant is a sharp yes it's a woody stamp yes it's a correct sentence that means yes then question number 10 shrubs are bigger than trees is it so children shrubs are smaller than trees so the sentence is wrong so it should be no then a money plant needs support to grow yes or no children I, we have just now discussed that yes money plant needs support to grow and the sentence is correct so the correct answer is yes short answer question Question number 12, which plant is stronger, rose or basil? You can see only, we have learned rose is a, rose have woody stem. So, which one is the stronger? It is the rose plant. Then moving to the next part, name any two herbs. Children, you can write anything. You can directly see from the book also, textbook and write it is mint and basil. You can leave, uh, write, sorry, coriander also. Okay, children. Now moving to the next page. It is page number 34. You cannot tie a swing to this plant. Children, you love playing swing, isn't it? And there the pictures are here. In which plant, plant you can't tie swing? So the correct option is number C, money plant. Okay, money plants are not stronger like the trees. Then moving to the question number 15, what type of plant is shown in the picture? You can see the picture and you can identify it. It's in the ground. It's a, it's called creeper. Very good. Now moving to the next page number 35 and question is number 16. You eat leaf, leafy vegetables in your meals. What type of plants are they? Children, you can see you will... Leafy vegetables are good for our health. And in a picture, in our right hand side, the picture is given. What it is called, children? It is called the herbs. They are called herbs. Then, question number 17. Look at the picture below on which one can a tree 
house be built why so there are two pictures in a children you can see banyan tree and a rose plant now they have asked on which one of a tree house b can be built so and why definitely it can be built in the on the banyan tree so and why because it has thick and strong woody stem okay it has thick and strong woody stem but you have a rose plant they have they are shorter and th though they have weak plants but they are short smaller okay then moving to the next page the last page that is page number 36 and the question is i explore question number 18 sia planted a pea plant in her garden the plant started growing after a few days she noticed that it was not able to stand straight what should she do children pea plant we have learned that it's a climber so the pea the plant needs support so what she, uh, sia is going to do she should use stick to support the plant to climb if she give the stick if she uh, give a support then definitely the pea plant will grow, uh, grow or climb okay because it's a climber okay children this here we are coming to the end of the chapter and we have already completed the recap and plus the workbook okay children in the next class we are going to start with our revision class and thank you and have a nice day ahead